Good evening, I'm Barbara Harrington. State Senator Karen Tallian is running for Indiana governor. She's expected to make the official announcement tomorrow, but told the Times of Northwest Indiana that there is, quote, a Grand Canyon between her and Governor Mike Pence, and people might want to take a look at the view from the other side. Tallian has served in the state Senate since 2005 and has been critical of Pence. She'll face former House Speaker John Gregg in the Democratic primary. Pence hasn't announced his intention to run for a second term. And high school and college football players are more likely to get a concussion during practice than during a game. That's according to a recent study from two Indiana researchers. It found that 58% of concussions happened during practices. A figure that doesn't surprise Indiana High School Athletic Association Commissioner Bobby Cox. He hopes the study will help highlight steps the IHSAA is trying to take to limit concussions. And Hoosiers will be getting more refunds from the Bureau of Motor Vehicles over the next couple of months as further overcharges surface. Now an outside assessment of the BMV has revealed rampant problems within the embattled agency. The BMV, in the wake of lawsuits over fee overcharges and millions handed out in refunds, hired consulting firm BKD to evaluate the agency. BKD's report was released today and uncovered numerous issues, including problems with the BMV leadership structure, a complex fee system, and a lack of internal controls and effective oversight. Now let's take a look at your weather for the rest of the week tonight. A 90% chance of thunderstorms. Keep those umbrella handies with a low of 52 degrees. And then the rest of the week, Tomorrow, a high of 66 degrees with partly cloudy skies. Wednesday, a high of 68 with partly cloudy skies. But get outside before the weekend, folks, because we have a chance of storms the rest of the week. Have a great night.